if the budget is tight and you have to go shopping for everybody for clothes, like if you have a big family and you don't have time to be spending all that money, y'all better go to the thrift store. Y'all better go to Goodwill. I've been shopping for gaps in my own wardrobe and I typically don't buy things for my children from thrift stores. I just buy their clothes brand new because it's just less of a headache. <laughs> Look, But I have the time and the energy to do it for myself. Anyway, I've been shopping for gaps. Today I was unsuccessful for myself, but my children were with me. So of course they started picking stuff up. So let me show y'all what I got for them. And while we were in, I was like, let me see what they got for babies. Y'all. Goodwill, I love Goodwill. And I will also add, Goodwill is a lot better in my area than the thrift stores because the thrift stores are starting to raise their prices. I think they're catching on to the fact that thrifting is trendy, whatever. But Goodwill still got sense. And let me tell y'all, all of this stuff for my baby was priced less than $5 a piece. This was $3.99, $2.99, $2.99, $2.99, $2.99. $2.99, $2.99. So like all of this for him, these pieces were less than $5 each. Um, and I got a good bit of stuff. It's a vest, some jeans for him, some little pants with suspenders. I'm probably taking the suspenders off. A long sleeve shirt. This I probably shouldn't have got because he is about to be cold. But he's probably still going to be in it in the springtime because he seems to be growing taller and not wider. Um, this is also a short sleeve shirt, but he can layer it. It's cute. It's in really good condition. I just could not pass this sweater up. This is I love things that make him look like a little gentleman. Um, and then for my big girls, they went looking for stuff as well. And they got, like, I got, all of this stuff was $2.99. No, but I got these for my big girl. Um, and Goodwill has dressing rooms, unlike many of the other thrift stores, so you can go in there and try the stuff on. I got these for the little one. And then they each, well, she got a few pairs of jeans. And then they each got, this sweater was 100% wool, y'all, and it was $4.99. The jeans were $2.99 a piece. The Abercrombie and Fitch jeans were $6.99. That's these right here. I don't know why they're $6.99. They got all these holes in them, but she likes the stretch jeans. This one, I think, was also $2.99. And it's 100% cotton. Um, and it still had the tag attached. <laughs> but yeah, so this was actually brand new. She she had good eyes on that one. And then this one was $3.99. So I got all of that stuff. Did not get anything for myself. I still have three things that I would like to fill my wardrobe with. At this point, I may actually go ahead and cave and look on Poshmark because I know it's going to be easier. And I am getting to my wits end because it's only like three more things that I need. Um, but yeah, moral of the story. I don't know what the moral of the story is. Thrift stores are cheap and there's nothing wrong with wearing secondhand clothes. And if you have a lot of children, you probably should do that. Because I, like I said, this cost me... 50 to 60 dollars to get all of this stuff for my children today and quite honestly if things were tight baby i'd be up in there all the time but i like to thrift for myself because i can get quality for the low i forgot to add that we also got this it just needs to be cleaned off but i don't even know how much this was but this is in the total of the 50 something dollars that i spent so yeah